In John John Florence coming into this event, world number three. Taking on Ian Gentile. Gentile, rookie of the year last year, representing the island of Maui. Just a short flight over to Oahu where John was uh, born and raised. A lot of sunshine, a lot of clean conditions. Here's George Pitar pulling in under the hood and oh. finding the escape route. Just to have a little bit of fun to kick this one off. Wild cards are allowed to do whatever they want, really. They can try <laughs> to push the world's best. He's right here with them this year oh, once again. Why wouldn't you? Western Australia is honestly one of the best places in the world. As we have a little look at the side-on vision of Georgie Pitar's opening wave. Just came through at a 2.17, but he did well just to punch through that. I thought he was definitely done, but just muscled his way out of that one. It was just a little bit deep on the takeoff. You Margaret River and doing some big frontside punts. Uh, doing some great go-behind filming work with Jack Robinson as we've got G Gentile just kind of forcing a start here. He'll step off. We'll talk to Kipes in just a moment here because we've got some live action. Ian Gentile looking for a one oh. big section, a tough way to Ooh. go down with the fins flying at you. Incomplete on the air attempt. Lucky land and now it will there. be George Pitar. Snapping it under the lip. There's a little whitewater section incomplete. A tough start to this seat. 19 on the clock. A lot of ones and twos. This is George Pitar. Yeah, this was a nice looking wave. This happened during that interview. First carving maneuver. Backs up with that second one. Everything's looking so good here until this last section. Off there at the end. And behind him is John. Pulls into that first section, but that's this is Ian. Up into the lip there on that first turn. Carves into that second maneuver there. Gets a third little wrap on the end section. And kicks out of there just before it goes dry on that inside. This wave here is definitely going to be counting for something really important at this stage in the heat. Trying to put a bit more space between himself and John. With a six point ride. That six feels gigantic now, considering what the what we've had so far in the heat as Ian's up and out. Yeah, I knew it was going to be a good score, just, just judging from the two first big calves we saw from George. He, event number five of the season is all about surviving the cut as we look at Ian Gentile for a snap through the lip, kind of full on the open face, wraps the cut back into the pocket and steps out. Remember last year, Gentile was so stressed out with the drama, really going to get heated there. Gentile knows he's in a tough spot as we watch this angle. Yeah, he's just trying to drop that 1.87. He gets a few maneuvers done here, which I'm pretty sure a couple of maneuvers. And if he's just patient enough, looks like he's going to commit now. John Florence, two-time event champ, split peak with Gentile. First snap off the lip. Nice speed float. Around the corner, jams it on the open face, taps the end Ooh. section on oh, dry. Rocks there, oh. the famous bricks. So three maneuvers there for Ian. Trying to improve. He was trying to improve on that 2.57, but John on his wave, straight up into the lip, into a lip line floater, jams and in the pocket there. A little float, <laughs> and then finishing up on that incredibly shallow end section, which we call the bricks. You can really see just how shallow it is from this drone angle here. On third, here's the left from Ian. Yeah, so a bit of a cut back there for that first maneuver. Wave starts to steepen up. A loosey-goosey tail slide there. Gets around that section with a bit of a foam climb. So we see George. Couple of nice turns, holding his speed well. The wild card from Manly Beach. Learning to surf in Vanuatu. Moving a 2-1-7, I'd say he's done that as we see John again. John finding a section to throw the tail towards the beach, falling on the flat spin reverse. So he's starting to feel the sense of urgency. I remember talking to Travis Logie, who is just wrapping up his tour life. As we watch John now, two minutes on the clock, throwing wow. away a punt. I'm seeing a performance like that from a competitor. I have to try to pretend that I could do the same thing. As we look at Gentile, kind of feel his way through a soft pocket, punches the fins out, gets stuck. That's going to be a throwaway with a minute 42. George Pitar making a big effort for that one. John is able to get it underneath. Little tap there, and that's not it. Seeing the frustration 
as he only needed a 3.24. 15 seconds. Ben Teal in seconds. A crucial one for him as he's got the cut line right on his back. And wild card, George Batar from Bells to Margaret River building his profile in back-to-back -back events on the championship tour. 